Every year on June 14th, we celebrate World Blood Donors Day. On this day, we come together to raise awareness about the importance of blood donation and also to understand the impact of this blood donation around the world. This year, we are celebrating the 20th anniversary of World Blood Donors Day with the theme 20 years of celebrating, giving. Thank you, blood donors. Do you know that in every few seconds, someone in the world needs blood? Be it a newborn or an old age, be it our friend or a relative, every one in three of us requires blood once in their lifetime. Blood transfusion may be required for various medical situations. Be it thalassemias, sickle cell anemias and any of the surgical illnesses or for any major surgeries. In this era of medical tourism, patients travel from abroad and from different states for high-end treatment like solid organ transplant, bone marrow transplant, cardiac surgeries, cancer treatments. And if you see road traffic accidents, which is major uh, part in our Tamil Nadu state, uh, contributing to the major blood loss that also requires blood donations or blood components for the transfusion therapy. So for this purpose, voluntary blood donation and access to safe blood is crucial in saving such lives and treat many other medical conditions. Anyone above the age of 18 and weight of above 45 kgs and hemoglobin of around 12.5 grams per deciliter can donate blood. And if you are worried about your diabetes and hypertensive, if you are still on medication, you are still allowed to donate blood. One whole blood can save up to three to four people as it can be prepared into packed red blood cells, plasma, cryoprecipitate and platelets. You can also opt for component donation like platelet donation. When you have decided to donate blood, here are few things to keep in mind. Have a hearty healthy meal before the blood donation and have a good adequate sleep the night before. You take plenty of fluids and water. Also, if you are on medication, take the prescription with you. And when you go for medical examination, fill the questionnaire honestly. When you donate blood, the body usually recovers faster. The blood volume usually re restorates within 24 to 48 hours. And red cells will take 6 to 8 weeks. And platelets and WBCs takes less than 24 hours and that's why males are allowed to donate every three months and females are allowed to donate every four months and if you are donating platelets even you can donate four times in a month and 24 times a year and the entire process takes 30 minutes and while the actual donation takes only 10 minutes post donation you will be monitored for 15 minutes and doctors will guide you accordingly So apart from saving lives and having a feeling of gratitude, it also has benefits. It reduces the risk of stroke and heart disease and also your body regenerates the cells faster when you donate blood. On this day, we celebrate the heroes among us, those who donate blood regularly, those who have come for the first time to donate blood, those who impact and organize the blood donation drive. We thank you all for your immense support and timely help. Have a happy safe blood donation.